Yes. Well, I'd like to uh, first thank you for, for all your work that you do and this wonderful talk tonight and coming thank here. You. Um, my question relates to the uh, second philosophical argument that you give for why the universe has a beginning. Um, I was wondering if you could comment on why the number of events in the past can be thought of as set formed by successive addition. Um, to me, it seems like it might be logically possible that the number of events in the past are infinite and therefore cannot be thought of a, a set formed by successive addition. Uh -huh. I think you can avoid this premise by th adopting a theory of time according to which temporal becoming is an illusion. Uh, according to which the difference between past, present, and future is just a subjective feature of human consciousness. This is sometimes called a tense-less theory of time because on this view there is no objective present or past or future. Events in time are strung out in a line in the same way that events are in space. And so on this view it is not as though um, the past was formed one event at a time, one occurring after another. The whole timeline just exists and our past is just relative to where we are on the line and what is earlier than that point. And so I supplemented my work on the cosmological argument by an extensive investigation of these competing theories of time and published two books on this, The Tenseless Theory of Time, A Critical Investigation, The Tensed Theory of Time, A Critical Investigation. And my studied opinion for which I argue is that the tensed view of time is correct, temporal becoming is an objective and real feature of reality and therefore in fact the series of past events really has been formed by successive addition. So if you're interested in pursuing that further, take a look at the work that I've done on God and time. Uh, a nice uh, student level uh, book would be called Time and Eternity, published by Crossway Books. That contains the essential arguments in it. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm.